Getting to this point took a lot of hard work from Albuquerque police. They say the 16s left their mark at numerous homes the night Garrick was killed. Tonight, Action 7 News reporter Laura Terrain talked to a mom whose kids found some of the key evidence. And as you're about to see, Laura did as well. Here in these bushes, a crucial clue that would help Albuquerque police piece together the murder case against six teenage suspects. So I said, you know, make the place look nice, pick up the trash. Savannah Lynch says two of her kids were pulling weeds near Wantabo and Central two weeks ago to make some quick summer cash when they stumbled upon a wallet. They went inside and they said, I think somebody got robbed. The kids turned it over to Jim Smith and he called police. Turns out cops say it belonged to Steve Garrick's wife and was stolen the night he was shot to death in his driveway. The wallet led police to these cameras at Smith's ultimate linings. Detectives say the surveillance video showed two unknown males throwing items into an alleyway, and police say those images helped detectives make the six arrests. Until we talked to her, Lynch said she had no idea her kids played such a big role. Now that you know, are you proud of your kids? Yeah. I mean, they could have just easily thrown that wallet in the trash or, you know, just left it there for a few more days. And just like Lynch's kids never expected to find that wallet, we never expected to find these. Vinnie Garrick's bank card and blood donation card still sitting on the ground 17 days later. We called police and they came to pick it up. More evidence in a case that's far from resolved. Laura Terrain, KOAT Action 7 News.